In this video, we're going to focus on the Zoom Pinch option in the Chart.js plugin for Zoom in Chart.js 3. So what is very important here is basically with the Pinch option, you can create a mobile Zoom in functionality by understanding the gesture of Pinch. So with this, we can enable this Pinch gesture. And so the chart in the Chart.js will be zoomed in the moment you pinch on it on your mobile phone. Sadly enough, this is a desktop and I'm not able to mo to emulate it as a mobile phone. So we I cannot demonstrate it to you. But what I will show you is how you can activate that so you know how to enable that. Another quick reminder is, and that's what we did in the very beginning of it. And if you didn't do it, make sure you have the, the Hammer.js JavaScript library included in your, your file. And the reason why is this will help you to understand or this understands the pinch option or the pinch gesture on a mobile phone and con can convert it into a zoom. So this is absolutely crucial together with the chart.js uh, plugin for zoom. So make sure this first and then afterwards this one. All right. So this is the most important one. So let's start and explore this. So what we're going to do here is basically we go first to our documentation here. And in the documentation, we have the options. You see here the pinch. This is the option of the pinch behavior. All right. So if I click on this, you can see there's basically just only one item here. By default, it is set on phones. And we need to enable this one. So we're going to enable that. To do this, I'm going to comment out the drag functionality. But you could maintain a drag functionality because the pinch option will only be active on mobile phone. So it, it's not working on a desktop unless your desktop has a touchscreen functionality. All right, so what we're going to do here is the following. We're going to say a comma. Then we say here pinch because we're going to deal with the pinch item. And then within here, we can put in here enable. And then we say equals true. We will set this on true. Once we save that, it refresh it here and then it should work but of course we don't have any pinch option functionality here so i cannot show you that but this is basically the way you will activate that one and this will not conflict with drag because drag is just different with the mouse button while pinch is specifically with two finger or two pressure points on a screen that the screen can convert or understand that this movement or this gesture is a pinch Thank you for watching this video and I hope you enjoy it. And if you enjoy this video, you probably will enjoy this one as well. And if you're interested in Chart.js, check out in the description box the link directing to my Chart.js course where you can learn everything about Chart.js. And finally, of course, make sure you subscribe to my channel.